Good morning guys. So we have a new product out here. Um, as guitarists you always use picks, you're always trying to find which is the best plectrum really and you know how to improve your efficiency, your speed, economy picking, all these sort of things, right? So I got here a product which helps me test every sort of plectrum there is from one of my reliable providers which is Dunlop so this is the variety pack and I don't know if you guys can see it's pretty tiny that's oh there you go so it's got a Tortex uh, 88mm Tortex 1cm uh, Tortex 0.9 ultra sharp 1.1 uh, pore uh, ultra sharp Heavy celluloid shell, red jazz nylon three, 0.88 nylon standard, one millimeter, one centimeter nylon standard, 0.88 max grip, 1.14 max grip, 0.96 gator grip, and 1.14 gator grip. So these are all in here, and these are like some of the really popular and well-known picks from Dunlop. I got the medium and heavy because I don't use a light. I don't really know. Maybe during strumming or. I'm not sure where light is really used, but I'll leave in the comments below if you guys have suggestions on where you would use light plectrums versus medium or heavy plectrums. But this is the pack I've got, which I've used a bunch of these plectrums over the years, and I'm really big fan of many of them. So here it is. So let's uh, just give it a try and open this up. So. Unfortunately, when you open this pack, the didn't give us a ziplock bag for this, which I guess would have been sort of helpful because I don't expect to take out all 12 picks at the same time. But inside the packing, inside this variety pack, they seem to be advertising for their own strings, the Dunlop strings. And as you can see, it's like the gauge 10 electric strings. And what does it say? It says log on to dunlopstrings.com. And it's a nickel plated. So we're gonna try that out pretty soon. It's pretty interesting. This is the variety 12 pack. So let's dig into these. Oh, it's pretty nice. Let's see. So we have these are the Tortexes. So it's the first one on the list, which is the really is the 0.88 Tortex. You can see it's pretty it's pretty strong I mean yeah it's not bad so I'm gonna try this out on the guitars just give me a second all right so I got my seven string beast out here and uh, just gonna try to pick all these put all these strings like let's try these plectrums one by one right so let's look for this is 0.8 Tortex, which was first mentioned. So there we got the 0.8 Dunlop Tortex, and let's try to pick and see. It's not bad. It's, uh, but I would say it lacks the grip as such. As it's it lacks the grip. I mean. I don't seem to like this at first glance. Maybe over time I learned it like this. I use picks learning. Let's look for the 1mm Tortex, which is. Uh, where are you guys? There it is. So that's the Dunlop 1mm. 1.12 Tortex. Oh, it's pretty different from what's written in the pack. So. Can you guys see this? It says, oh, let's pull this out. Yeah, it says, oh, it says one. Going blind, guys. So let's try this out. It's the same thing with this, right? Like, it seems better, but you know, I like these, these bad boys. This is what I like. These are just threes, I guess, but go and order 0 0.90 I'll take sharp it's this one I'm not sure how this really differs let's pull the tortex up 
it's uh, just got a sharper tip. I haven't used Altex this before. Let's try this out. Oh, I'm playing from there. It's like this the grip for these plectrums has to be a little different guys has to be folded and it's a little better because you can like just pick with the tip right so if you're noticing I'm just doing it's really good for economy picking really and string skipping that's what I feel um, so I'd give a thumbs up for this guys the Altex it's pretty good so let's have a look at the thicker Altex, that was the 0 0.90 Altex out there and uh, this is supposed to be the 1.14 sharp Altex as you can see all these are basically made in the USA so if you guys are fans of making USA sort of stuff it's a nice one so so I, I seem to like this more really compared to the 0 0.90 Altex, it seems to offer more resistance, it's more bulky, it's got more weight, really, and it's got weight on the top, I guess, and it's really nice. I really like this one. I think this is my pick of the lot till now. So it's going pretty good. Then we have the HWY Cellulite. Which one is that? Ooh. You guys know which one the cellular shell is heavy cellular shell and it doesn't have a value on it which is yeah that's the one oh this is called a gym download heavy look at that beauty look at that color that embossing it's just beautiful it looks a lot like the initial one, but it's thick. So, it seems nice. Like, so it's 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 nice, but I wouldn't recommend this for sweep picking or anything it's probably nice for just leads it's not great like any of these pointy tips it's it's not really great for rhythms or it's not a versatile like these are the nice ones really it's got those grips it really sticks on so let's just keep stick to the order we run through a lot of these so red jazz 3 there's my baby so Got the gin down with the classic, the one made in the US, Jazz 3. It's it's thick as hell. I think this is like 2mm, I'm not sure, but a lot of Jazz 3s I've used is like 2mm, but let's try this out. Look at that flat grip. So the beauty is it's, it's kind of short, so you got like a really good grip. You can grab it, you know, right there and it's just that little it's perfect for economy picking I really like this spot this bad boy is really nice even for like if you want to go like palm muted it's really nice I really love this and I mean, I'm sorry guys I had a bias before itself I've used most of these but I really love this guy that's my pick. I'm gonna keep this on the side and let you guys know that that's the pick of the lot till now. It's the Jin Dunlop Jazz 3. Next we got is the 0.88 Nylon Jazz Standard. So I guess these are the Jazz ones. Oh, those are the Jazz. Uh, yeah, those are the Jazz. So this is 0.88 Nylon Jazz and the others are the Max Grip. Oh, this is nice. I really like this. This is really nice guys it's a good one I'll keep this in the top three for sure it's doing pretty well so let's look at the 1 mm nylon this this one mm, dig it. it's pretty dark you can't see it really 
it's hard to see even with the naked eye. So let's just get it. Ah, oh, yeah, this is the, you can feel it because it's got this tiny grip, this writing, right? Acts as a grip, and it's got the grip on the side. It's one mm. It's, it's really beauty. It's going on the top. Then we come to the max grip ones. It's got a point eight eight max grip, and yeah, look at that bad boy. It's a really good one. Yeah, max grips, I think they're versatile because it's got. I, I can feel it. I can feel myself playing this pretty well. Yeah, that's that's a good one. It's really good. This is the one M Max Grip. So the difference between the thinner and the thicker Max Grip one is really in the 1.14. I can feel more resistance coming from the bottom. And the top it's heavier. It's better, to be honest. You have more control, and it's just much better. So I'd probably choose this over the other Max Grip, and let's try out the last of the Gator Grip ones classic uh, made in US ones I really like this material it's so soft it just feels great it's more of the bluesy sort of stuff I would... these are really good it's a classic plectrum so I really like these ones and probably I don't know I think I like the bigger the thicker one of this let's try it out oh yeah look at that feel the weight this is considerably heavier, it's 0.88, that was 0.96 and this is 1.14. 1 it's feel the difference, this is pretty good. So it's actually a tough call, I got five of my plectrums out here. It's five of the best and actually some of them are better than uh, the Jazz 3. So the Jazz 3 is the lead plectrum for sure. Then we have uh, a couple of nylon grips, I guess. So I'm gonna take the bigger nylon one. So we have four, really choose from. The four, I think then. Mm. Well, nylon is pretty good, like for Jazz stuff. This Max Grip is amazing for versatile playing cards and everything I'd go for this this is like a blues pick it's a blues pick really you can get the feel and it's just got the one man so these are my top four this is a jazz three um, the nylon uh, plectrum which is one mm one centimeter standard the gator grip 1.4 one four and uh, you have the max grip 1.14 so these are the four ones i would always keep in my wallet and it's just you guys keep it as well on the road so if you like guys like this video and you want to see more please support me and uh, hit the subscribe button right below uh, give us a thumbs up if you really like this video please give us comments on how to improve and things to do what do you want to see i keep following the comments it's pretty interesting and really helpful thanks guys cheers